Namaste and warmest greetings on India's 75th Independence Day. This has been another challenging year and we salute the resilience and sacrifice of the Indian people who have displayed the same fortitude which helped secure India's freedom as an independent nation. Thankfully, the immediate lead up to this year's celebrations have been brightened by Team India's performance at the Tokyo Olympics, especially the gold medalist Neeraj Chopra, who has lifted the spirits of 1.3 billion people. He's a true inspiration, especially for the next generation of young Indians. As the whole world seeks a sustainable route out of the pandemic, India has a pivotal role to play in building back better. It is therefore pleasing to see the collaboration between UK and India also intensifying. Earlier this year, the UK committed to deeper engagement in the Indo-Pacific. On the back of this, our two countries agreed a 2030 roadmap on future relations, including the ambition to double bilateral trade. And Indian students in the UK, which exceeded 55,000 in the last academic year, can now benefit from two years work experience following their studies. We also look forward to India's active participation in the COP26 summit in Glasgow in November, where the whole world will gather to raise our collective ambition to combat climate change and prevent the loss of biodiversity. So, as the Indian tricolour is raised to celebrate today's important milestone, we stand in solidarity with the hopes and aspirations of the Indian people united by our shared values and committed to a healthier, prosperous and more sustainable planet for us all. Namaste and Happy Independence Day.